Millions of years ago, a planet was silently making its way through the expanses of outer space when suddenly it met another large celestial body and burst into pieces as a result of the collision. Larger fragments continued their existence as asteroids, and smaller ones became meteorites and meteors. Each of these rocks has a trajectory of its own, determined by the collision. Of the billions of the planetary fragments flying through space, a few come close to Earth and even fall on our planet. 75% of all asteroids so far analyzed by researchers are carbonaceous. Not exactly fascinating since coal and graphite are quite common on Earth as well, but carbon may also mean diamonds, and that is definitely something worthwhile. The second most common are stony asteroids. They make up 15% of the overall number and are indeed boring. The remaining 10% are metallic asteroids, for which scientists have high hopes related to the possibility of mining for valuable ores and minerals. We've already mentioned gold and platinum, and it's common knowledge that gold is cool and plays a central role in the global economy. However, in reality, precious metals are not necessarily the most expensive or sought for. The modern high-tech industry has a huge demand for other elements. If you've never heard about rhenium, don't be surprised. This is a rare metal. The global supply of it is estimated to be a mere 13,000 tons. One pound of it may cost up to $4,500. Rhodium is another rare metal, with the global supply of 30,000 tons and the price tag of one ounce currently being $700. Rhodium is indispensable for manufacturing certain high-tech products, and its overall quantity on the planet is not growing. Other metals that can be found on asteroids include ruthenium, nickel, and molybdenum. This is an entire treasure trove worth of metals which are rare on Earth. Somewhere between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter, a huge asteroid named Psyche circles around the Sun. This celestial rock, 157 miles wide, consists almost completely of iron-nickel alloys. An ore cache of this size could satisfy the needs of humankind for millions of years. In 2015, the asteroid UW158 passed by Earth. It was really small as they come, just 1,050 by 500 feet. This space rock, too tiny to even have a name, contained 100 million tons of platinum. That's at least $300 billion in current prices. But platinum wasn't the only metal it had. Scientists believe the total price of all ores contained in this asteroid would add up to $5 trillion. Now, if you recall Psyche, the 157-mile-wide metallic asteroid, its total worth is estimated to be $10,000 quadrillion. Imagine that! Since the entire economy the economy of planet Earth is worth 78 trillion bucks, that one asteroid is worth 128,000 times the world's economy.